I am the rocket man they talk about. I jump from star to star, I'll walk it out. Hey there guys, my name is Shibby2142, and today we're playing some more Battlefield 4, and today's gameplay is going to be more Pump Shotgun, but I will be trying out the Slugs to show you guys some of that gameplay. So instead of the, the Buckshot Pellet Spread, we're going to be trying out the Slugs, which is more of like a one-shot, you try to hit them, be accurate, but we'll, we'll see how that works out. We also have some Sniper gameplay when I run around and pick up the M8283 CQB. And yeah, it's going to be a full gameplay to show you guys, you know, how I kind of play the map and have some fun. We'll have some thoughts and we'll also have some comments about Call of Duty Ghosts, how it will compare to Battlefield 4, and a, a comment or two from you guys. So make sure to leave a comment below for me to either feature or just kind of read and see your thoughts. And that'll be great. So uh, let's get started. The range on just the stock buckshot is actually pretty good. Notice how this guy is behind cover. And eventually enough pellets will hit that I do end up killing him, but that's that's pretty respectable. Like I said in my prior gameplays, is the shotgun overpowered? Uh, it's very strong, I'm not really sure yet, I haven't played around on enough maps. But for a smaller game type, map-wise, like Domination, it's just, it's just really good. So expect a lot more shotgun gameplay from me, because it's just really fun to see what kind of streaks you can go on, because you can get that one-shot kill. And it's, it's a little bit of a different thought process than an assault rifle where you want to turn the corners, be aiming down sights, look for any movement. Shotgun, you kind of just go really, really aggressive and just see what happens. So sometimes you will completely fail and fall on your face, and you expect to get a one-shot, you don't, and then you die. But th there's just so much possibility for just domination on domination when using a shotgun. Now let us kick it off with today's video feature comment so if you guys are interested in being the feature comment leave me something below and i'll just kind of pick one so from daro dism he says i think i as a fan since 2002 have the right to say that after playing every battlefield game that they have lost their edge with bad company to deliver the true battlefield original fan base target with both feel engines and etc played battlefield 4 both on his new pc and console at the event Dice went like COD did money. Same as Starbucks did with their diet bakery, piece of crap everyone hates now. Still play once in a while, only with organized matches with friends. No BS players in my clan. Okay, now I don't quite agree with Darodism. I if if he was trying to say that bad company was where Battlefield lost their edge to deliver a true Battlefield experience. I, I don't know if I would quite agree with that. While Bad Company was a little bit different, I felt like Bad Company focused more on the gunplay and just infantry. A lot of the maps didn't have a ton of vehicles. Let's say, for example, you played a 32-man rush on Valparaiso. You would have the APC-type vehicle, the Bradley, I believe. Uh, real military terms for that, I'm not really remembering. Like armored infantry transport, something like that. Anyways, that would be on the attacking team, and then eventually you would get the Blackhawk as you progress through the rush map. And that was really it. The defenders didn't get anything. It was it was really focused on just infantry gameplay, and you had your sniping from the lighthouse, and you had your motion balls, and you were throwing C4 everywhere. That, I I really enjoyed that. What the everything in Bad Company from the hit markers to weapon balance I felt like was really good. At the start, the M60 and AN94 were grossly overpowered, which was kind of fun because you would basically, between a two and a three shot kill on people, depending if you got a headshot in between, it was it was ridiculous. You would just mow everyone down, and that was great. So I, I do respect the, the opinions of all you guys. I don't know if I'd quite agree with that comment, if that's uh, what we're talking about. That's where Battlefield lost it. I feel like Battlefield 3 was kind of where it started going downhill for me because of the suppression and just how they would not tweak that and the M26 dart. I don't know. They kind of they went a little over their heads and I feel like this this Battlefield 4 will be the true Battlefield experience that we have been seeking. And I'm just oh, so excited for it. Turning back to the gameplay, we are now using the slugs on the shotgun and you can tell that is true by seeing me modify my loadout 
And also now you have a crosshair instead of the scope that the circle scope crosshair. So as you saw there, I got one shot and then that slug to that guy right there that just died. That did, looks like about 95 damage. So it's not always a one shot kill depending on where you hit them, which I think is fair. And I've come to, uh, I guess, expect that now after playing with this weapon a little bit. So a kill like that, I feel like in Bad Company 2 would have always been a one shot. To the upper chest, one slug, you would be done. The slugs in Bad Company 2 on the 870 were, I would say, balanced because you need to stop to shoot. Like, you could never fire on the move. It was very, very strong, but I felt like it was a very particular play style, and no one could just pick it up and own. Like, you had to know what you're doing. And also, you could do the recoil can not recoil cancel, the reload animation cancel, which uh, sped it up a bit and it just it kind of add a little skill ceiling to that particular loadout that made it really fun. So also have to play around with the slugs a bit more on the shotgun and see how I like them because a few of those kills was if I was using the buckshot it would have been a one shot, but the the slug you get a little more range. So we'll see how that relationship kind of melds itself together as we see more maps and more play styles and. We'll see if the game's going to have more shotguns so far. We've seen the QBS and the 870 so far. Not a bad shot right there. A drip in the shotgun's house. All right, guys. So I think where we want to go with the channel is a lot of Battlefield 4, Team Fortress 2, and then we'll do some variety such as Trouble in Terrace Town, Grand Theft Auto Online, things of that nature. So if you guys think that's a good choice, let me know. I don't want to be doing too much, but I do want to bring Battlefield back as a strong presence on my channel. And because of that, can we reach 1,000 likes on this video? My channel did start with Battlefield, and then we did kind of move into Team Fortress 2 as well, but it really was like 50-50 on my channel. Not saying we can do that once again. Maybe we can with Battlefield 4. But I want to see, are, are you Battlefield fans still there? Can we can we do that? Can we try to reach that, that threshold of 1,000 likes on the video? That would be awesome. I would love to see your guys' support and comments below. So let me know. Let, let, let's go for it. It's, it'll, it'll be the highest rated Battlefield video I've had in a long time. My team ends up winning the round. I went 22 kills and only 4 deaths. Anyways guys, my name is Shibby. Thank you so much for watching. If we could hit that like rating, that'd be great. And if you uh, have any Battlefield friends out there, make sure to share the video with them so we can bring Battlefield back to my channel. That'd be awesome. So subscribe for more. My name is Shibby, and hopefully I'll see you guys next time. All right, so let us start with some pump shoddy gameplay. One thing I love about this map and domination in general, it's very quick gameplay. Now, team group, the link to that is in the video description. All right, crap. The fact that I bust out the half-solid wishy, I always do this, no matter what. Even I am just, I just play like an idiot.